Hi, it's Barnaby for Spurred on outside the lane. A few, few seconds left, but it's Leicester, Spurs nil, Leicester one. Depressing. Very depressing. Um, you know, I thought we had the chances to, to win the game today, especially in the second half with Harry Kane. Um, Delhi had a, a strike in, in the second half that I thought, you know, could have gone in. It's just the same as, as recent, you know, crosses, set pieces. We look vulnerable. Um, I didn't think we played bad tonight. Um, it's just one of them games where it's just frustrating because you sense all the time Leicester, they can get a goal on the break, they can hit you on a set piece and the longer the game went on, you could kind of sense that might happen and, and it did. Yeah, absolutely. Um, oh, it's hard to know what to say really. It just had that inevitability about it. When I got to the ground, there was a sense of foreboding around. Is it just like a Spurs fan's knowledge of, of when we get this chance, not going to make the most of it well you know I said to the guy standing next to me who agreed he said you know when Kane's hit the bar in the second half he said it's going to be one of them days and uh, and he said you know I think I think we could nick it near the end I said yeah but they might and yeah. and they did so yeah. uh, just I don't want to pin, uh, pinpoint him every time but to me Tom Carroll's too lightweight for those games where there are big guys in the midfield you know I know you said a couple of was it last game of the game before he looked really good and I and I have to agree technically he's a fantastic player yeah. really really good um, but when you've got Musa on the bench who when he come on you could see the difference in the 50-50 challenges we looked like we controlled that midfield for the first five minutes he come on whereas before that it, we was losing it a little bit but whether he was fit enough, I don't know. But if he's if he's fit enough, why why is he on the bench if he's not fit enough? So, yeah. Well, going to Sunderland at home next game, got to turn it round. Is that will that happen? Yeah, I think it will happen. Um, obviously, it's it's just trying to stay positive. You know, it, it seems every time we get that chance to bridge that gap between the teams behind us. Yeah. We just seem to falter or I don't think it's having the bottle, maybe that bit of luck or it's just seeing through with a bit of conviction. But we, again, we've slipped up to again tonight and we could have made that five point gap. Now it's yeah. back at two again. Yeah. All right. Thanks for your thoughts, guys. Let us know what you think in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and follow us on Twitter at Spurred on TV. Thanks, guys.